We running? Yeah. All right, Shalom. We the Jim Mess Louisa and the Saints coming back at you with another precap as we do week in and week out. We're prior to getting started. We want to give infinite honors and prayers to Yahweh, Bashim, Yahushua, Bashim, Rehan, Kodash. Double honors to the elders and apostles that do teach and rule well, and salutation to the aquas that's pushing the truth and sincerity. And Lord willing, you brothers endure to the end. And at the end is where we are, man. All right, so hey, the scriptures tell us to gird up the loins of our mind, man. All right, and trust in those things that we have been assured of, man. All right, and I'm gonna go into a video basically dealing with men mental yoke. All right, because there's a yoke on the minds of the uh, of men, man. That's heavy, man. All right, because they carry so many thoughts. All right, they have to uh, uh, put all their thoughts in order, man. The scriptures tell you to set your mind right and constantly do. It. All right, so we gonna go into the scripture just basically exhortation on basically the yoke of your mind. All right, that you have it set all right that you can endure the things to come, man. Because hey. Hey, hey, the things that come gonna really blow our mind, man. We're gonna need that faith, that big faith, man. His brother did a video, all right, a month or so a little time back, and they called it Big Faith. Brothers reposted it and went deeply into it, man. That was a beautiful video, man. All right? And Jay be looking for the, all the extravagant videos, man, but isn't those videos that are base and simple, all right, are the most uh, 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 prominent videos, man, that you need, man, to continue to endure. All right, with no, with no further ado, we're gonna get into it. Bring it out. Come. This is Sirach chapter 40, verse one. Yep. Greatly, great travail is created for every man. Yep. And a heavy yoke is upon the sons of Adam. Yup. Hey, a heavy yoke is upon the sons of Adam, man. And where a yoke lie? We're not talking about an iron of yoke around our neck, man. All right? That yoke is now is on a what has been transferred to the mind or the mental part, all right, of the sons of Adam, which is there probably talking about what? In that case, we're talking about the what? The sons of, of God, man. All right, Yasha Allah, man. What? From the day that they go out of their mother's womb yep. to the day that they return to the mother of all things. That's right, man. So, hey, our minds are plagued daily, man. Okay, from family members, all right, to work people that work with you. You see, the job, all right, the, uh, the environment. All right, the, 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 the economy, okay? We could go into several things where your mind is going to be plagued. But even with a plagued mind, we ought to still serve the Lord. The Lord say, hey, serve me in a perfect manner, man. Be perfect while you're serving me, man. Even in the, you, I'm going to say this, even in the, in the, the toughest and hardest times, man. Dealing with the work, the wife, the kids, your own body having sicknesses and illnesses. talk about this like that no we go through what's called feelings man all right but we know how to subjugate our feelings versus from letting our feelings guide and control us go ahead we mortify our members, we mortify our members yep when it says uh and our devices are but uncertain yep our devices are are uncertain which goes into our imaginations too man you see go ahead with a corruptible body pressing down the soul yep in the early tabernacle weighed down the mind that muzzled upon many things. Right, because our mind do think about many things. Hey, think of, of what's on the mind of a, of, a, of a man of the Lord, that way he gotta teach this word, man. He gotta make sure he don't air off. He gotta have his and the set up right. All right, he gotta also deal with his house. He can't be a lion in his house. He gotta deal with his children. All right, he gotta walk in, in, in society as Claw Kent. All right, he got to go to work and deal with, it's, it's, it's a multitude of things, all right, that be on his mind because it's easy for the mind of a man who don't serve the Lord. All you got to do is just walk around and be with him, man. 
he don't got to think about, well, is this right? Is this righteous? Because I'm supposed to walk alone this, or am I supposed to refrain from that, man? There's, there's no conditions. There's no conditions. You see, all he got to do is, man, hey, I just need to do this and do that. Because he have nothing to structure his uh his actions and his doings, man. He's not looking towards him. Right. He don't have nothing to fear. Somebody just put a battery in back, battery in his back like go. a drone and let him go and burn his business. And go, yeah. Like a Duracell battery with a commercial. Yeah, with a, let him go. Well, it was going, you know? Yeah. When you don't have nothing to fear, man, you don't have any, any, <laughs> you don't got no boundaries. Your limitations, you don't have no restrictions, limitations, or boundaries. We have strict and limitations and boundaries that yoke our mind, man. Statues. Meaning what? Statues, statues. And statues, man. Yeah. On how far and where we could go, which way in our mind, because we're regular people, we want to, you know, sometimes go a, a little out there or, you know, on the beach or do some extra things. But we got to watch how we do that. Now we got to watch, watch how we walk in the sand on the beach because we represent you. How will you all shot, man? Our yeah. behavior is on this plane constantly. Boy. You got to have your source, got to be your how about shot. It yep. got to be your main source. Right. Everything starts with that, and he take care of everything else around him. Right. As long as you keep him first, which goes to your faith. Right. Yeah, get that one. Oh, you read that? So I, uh, I still got verse two. You still got verse two? Uh oh, y'all bring him out. Get on my elbow. Go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead, go ahead. Just to back up what you were saying about how a man of the Lord constantly has to, uh, uh, constantly has to observe every step he makes in the yep. society, because hey, there's a multitude of ways you can go off. Which just adds the the, the predicament we're in that uh, that uh, mental iron or yoke, yoke of iron. That's why you constantly just gotta stay in these scriptures, stay among the brotherhood, so you can know the right parameters to navigate through, so you can have the answer right when you need it. Yep. This is a uh, Psalms 19 and 13. Keep back thy servant also from presumptuous sins. Right. From presumptuous sins, man. That sins before they basically translate happen, man. You know. Basically what? You get, that's you setting your mind aright on how you can move your foot, man. All right? Because you move your foot in the wrong direction as a representation of the man of the Lord, the Lord going to condemn your ass, man. It's going to be an open open condemnation to the, to the whole body of the Lord and also to the world, man. You see? Instead of being entangled in this world, this, this world easily, man. If you're not girded and rooted in this thing, we've seen guys get rooted back into Islam, rooted back into the church. The church, the, the pastor runs some fire game on him. Yep. He's backing out with a suit, with grandma holding hands, man. You know what I'm saying? Praise the Lord, second this little light of mine, man. Now you you know? fully planted. Yeah, you, you were fully planted, and that's that's how you got to be in order to. <coughs> Understand the wiles of the devil day by day, and keeping your mind like the brother is iterating on this, this mindset. Your mind has to be right, man. Right, man. right, your mind walking day by day in this thing, man. You will get sucked up. Uh -huh. We had guys amongst us get sucked up back in the world, man. Because they why? Like you wanted, their mind ain't right, man. That's what the law called you out on. Yeah. Whenever he, hey, whenever men are getting moved around or, or, or put out. It's because they mind wasn't right. Matter of fact, even in Peter's, the Lord say, it is, it's in Peter's and one of the right having pulled. The Lord say, no, it wasn't me. Yeah. It, was it was you. It was Get you. It. Get it. That's a rock. 15. Yeah, it was you. Really? 15. Satan. Satan. It's 15 and like, uh, go down in the mirror. Yeah. Like about 11 and 12. Or is it 15 and yeah, 11? That's right. Yeah, that's it. That's why I say, give you your own yeah. lust. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah.
deep in the feet of your blood. Right. That's perfect. He said, say not that the Lord have tempted him. You see? That's James. I'm going to beg you. No, that's the one in James. That's the rock. You got the James? Yeah, that's the one that go together. All right, get the James. Yeah, get the James one Right. Yeah, yeah. The Sirach 15 verse 11 Say not thou It is through the Lord that I fell away Yahoo. For thou oughtest not to do the you things first, that he hated You first fall away You were there for mentally yeah, first it's, it's a thought process and, and proceeding on what you're doing man. If, if, if I could say um, We was having a, a, a conference call Thursday and we were talking about how the spirit It puts you, put you in the right direction huh? The spirit do have for you Oh, let me get that. You know, but once you start having those outside thoughts, that's the reason why the Lord said, "Don't be unequally yoked with unbelievers," because they start putting you in the wrong mindset. Huh? Mm -hmm. You know, that's the reason why you need to follow the Spirit. The Lord give you everything you need. We got everything we need. Follow, right? They say a righteous man got it. Got it. A righteous man got his affairs with discretion, man. Going back to Psalms, man. You said, see? Said thy house and all. Hey, this is what he just said. This wisdom of Solomon. 10 and 10, it says, when the righteous flee from his brother's wrath, she guide him in the right path. Show him the kingdom of the most high and give him knowledge of holy things, made him rich in, tra in his travails and multiplied the fruits of his labor. That's right. Hey, hey, and Ralph can condemn you in your own mind, man. A lot of men have been condemned by their wrath, man. That's why I say uh, Proverbs 19 and 11 tell you um, uh, the, uh, a man discretion um, deferred his anger, man. You see, a man discretion, Proverbs nineteen and eleven, de this, deferred his anger, man. The, any, any young brother could be coming in, the, coming in the camp or coming around to be a student in the camp. My whole, my whole thought process with you is, hey, bro, you just need to read the whole book of Sirach. <laughs> you just need to read the whole from front to back, because yeah. it tell you the do's and don'ts and how to guide yourself within this in this kingdom. We got everything in there. That's how to be with women. You name it, man. How to be with a brother, your children. You name it, man. Oh, he got that? Oh, let me finish this up. Yeah. Let me uh, get that James. Surah 15 and 11. Say not thou, it is through the Lord that I fell away. For thou oughtest not to do the things that he hated. Say not thou, he that causes me to err. For he have no need of the sinful man. Yahweh hated all abomination. And they that fear the Most High love it not. Right, so the Lord ain't caused you to err off. Let's see what caused you to err off, man. James 1 and 13. Let no man say when he is tempted. <laughs> See, when he what? Tempted. He is tempted, man. All right? Because the Lord try you, man. Tempt the Lord don't really tempt you. He try you, man. Listen, when you're tempted, you're going to fall into it, man. If the Lord put a bag of money right there and for you to steal it and you dead broke, you're going to steal the money, man. Yeah, man. Go ahead. It's still up there with the most high. I, I, I present to you this day life and death. Life man. and death. So you when, you're tempt, when you're tempted, it's still an option of doing and not doing. Yeah, man. which is it's on you. Yep. It goes in that because he's trying you, man. He gonna say he don't. He gonna tell you he don't tempt you. So yeah. will the Lord contradict himself? Go ahead. Let no man say when he is tempted, I am tempted of the Most High. Yep. I am what? Tempted of the Most High. So the Lord tell you, don't say when you tempted, you tempted of, of me. Don't say that. I ain't tempt your ass. Go ahead. It says for the Most High. Cannot be tempted with evil. <laughs> the Most High cannot be tempted with evil. He said he hate he hate a sinful man. That's why he said I don't hate man. I don't hate the sin. I hate the man. Yeah. The sin can't get be created unless the man did it, man. Yeah. The sin can't happen unless a man do it. Yeah. Adultery yeah. just sitting right there, and somebody's just like, all right, I gotta go get this adultery and do it. Adultery can't do itself. Last so, time I, I tell you, say, the Most High, he uh, he hate the sin and the sinner. He hate the uh, the sin and the sinner. Matter of fact, he ate both of them. Because people say he, he don't hate the person, he hate the sin. Church well shit. But how, but how can the sin even be uh, <laughs> it can't present? Do nothing. How it can be present or even do what it do unless somebody <laughs> does it, man? It's, when everything is a, when every reaction is a uh, reaction, man. It's every reaction, man. If I could make a, a slight point, it's just like how these people talk about gun control. You need to control the people, not control the guns. Hey, man. Right? Hey, brothers got, brothers got some shit. The motherfucker never just got up in the car and drove off, man. They got you back. And then you hit by, oh, man, that's what shit to do. Yeah. Running from the cops and shit. You just see a butt of a, a, butt of a gun running down the street, man. Right. Right. Gun don't do its hell thing, right? can't shoot itself. 
can't shoot nobody. It can't shoot nobody. It can't do nothing to itself but lay there. It's a person, man. Yeah, it's a dead image. It's a tool. It's, it's a, a tool. tool. It's a dead image, man. And people worship guns. Yeah. That's a dead image. You don't got no life, no point, no soul, nothing in it, man. Go ahead. So neither to any, any man. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I'm not really sure whether you're too stupid. You say, uh, neither tempt any man, go ahead. Neither tempt any man. Every man is tempted when he is drawn away of his own lust. Right, so, so he's tempted when he's drawn away of his own lust, which means that was created by him. He tempted his own self. The Lord, like, I'm not tempted. Even when you go to 1 Corinthians, I believe that's 10 and 13, when he say, uh, uh, any man of uh, temptation, uh, uh, I went... I'm paraphrasing to lock it. Every brother's got to read it so I can break it down. But you got to go into that word tip, man, and understand what it means, man. Read it real quick. This is 1 Corinthians 10 to 13. There have no temptation taken you, but such as is common to man. See, there's no temptation taking you such as common to man. And what's common to man is that he tempts himself, man. He tempts he tempt himself, man. Go ahead. You want me to get that word temptation? Get it. Let me read it again. 1 Corinthians 10 and 13. There have no temptation taken you, but such as is common to man. But the Most High is faithful, who will not suffer you to be tempted above that you are able. Right, so you're not going to be tempted above your able, which means tried above your able, man. The Lord of. Go ahead, bro. But, okay, let me just finish up. But will with the temptation also make a way to escape? Make a way to what? Escape. Go ahead. I'm going to say one way that we escape. But what's another understanding? Hey, brother, and a brother I talked yesterday, man. He didn't like trying to pull that carry shit with him in the store. And a brother used the scriptures, man. The yeah. brother had the armor of the most high on. Boy, this is demon. That's how you identify what's going on. Because being out right mind, like, fuck, fuck, come up in out of nowhere. One people with the basket. He can tell you what the fuck you're doing. You don't got the way. The brother said he just kept playing. You know, he kept his head down, man. He kept doing it and doing it's a demon. But we only know that. Read that part again. We only know that by the wisdom and knowledge and understanding of the Most High, man. When we are tempted. Go ahead. There have no temptation taken you, but such as is common to man. But the Most High is faithful, who will not suffer you to be tempted above that you are able. See? Because when it goes to be above that you are able, that means you're going to do it. That means you're going to... I can't... The Lord put money right there. You have money in three years, bro, and you need... You got bills back the mortgages you gonna take the money you gonna take it man so the lord don't do us that man i gotta so go man, ahead, man that's why paul said we said man paul made one of the heaviest statements paul by himself yeah. man paul said oh wretched man that i am oh, wretched man because he'll take that money man <laughs> if he should be fucked he gonna fuck up, he gonna fuck up yeah he said i'm a i'm, I'm a chief sinner <laughs> paul called himself a chief sinner man you see? Go ahead. I got, I got two points up in this. Uh, you gotta be real with yourself for it. I said it all the time. Go ahead. Huh? I got two points up in there for the word uh, temptation, temptation that go right. Yeah. Go it's, ahead. Uh, it yeah. Says, it's a certain word I would look at for two. All right. I'll go back to the word. I just want to make these No, no. I was saying there. those points. Go ahead. It, it says, be. of the condition of things or a mental state by which we are enticed to sin right. or to lapse from the faith and holiness. Right. So we're enticed to sin. Go back to that, James, because you ain't read that part. You didn't read the part where it was in Titus. It's the it's next, next, huh? It's next. Go ahead, go ahead. I'm going to read it 14 again, sis. But every man is tempted when he is drawn away of his own lust yep. and is enticed. He said, this is the point. And enticed. enticed. See? <laughs> go ahead. Says, then, when lust has con uh, conceived. When lust had conceived. So now lust entered into the picture. A man is driven by his own lust, man. His lust carry him away like that. Go ahead. And it says, it is bringing, it, it bringing forth sin. It, it, it is sin when it is finished, it's bringing forth for death. See? <laughs> I got something for you. Go ahead. It says, my God. It says, it says uh, yeah, uh, adversity, affliction, trouble sent by God and serving to test or prove one's character. It said to test or prove. He right, now, man. see, when you go into temp, you got to know what temp means. Because yeah. people, man, the Lord tempting me, man. The Lord trying you. He's if trying. you're a man of the Lord, trying, he tempt niggas. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, one's character, because the Lord knows. He character. know characteristics, man. And he going to see if you can beat that. That 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 inward man, or you gonna let you gonna let that that, that spirit out, or you gonna let that the Lord gonna try you because He can't allow you to fall away if He have called you to the grace to be ultimately be set. He, he can't fall away. Absolutely. If I tell him He's gonna fall away, man, go ahead. 
You want any more words on that? That's good. That's right, point yeah, to yeah, the yeah, point. Don't point. break nothing else down in there. What? Yeah, yeah. Uh, nothing. This is a uh, Sirach <laughs> 18. I'm gonna start at 30. Go, go not after thy lusts, yo, but refrain thyself from thine appetites. Right, and the way you go after your lusts is in your mind. Adultery begins in the mind. Then it's translated down. So that's why yeah. Yahweh Shah said, even when you thought of adultery, go ahead. Hey man, that's a that's a heavy one for the reading right here. Go ahead. <laughs> hey, adultery starts where? In your mind. You see? In your thoughts. That's why I say let go of the mortal thoughts. Your thought, the mortal thoughts, pull you into sin and, and sin leads to death, man. Right. Men and men have error in their in their in their thought patterns, man. Right. That's why that's why University of Zach Mississippi did a, did a lesson on how you feed you feed your mind for what? Thou givest thy soul the desires that please her, she will make thee a laughing stock to thine enemies that malign thee. Right. Hey, don't make it a fool. All right, because it said, prove thyself in thy life and prove thy soul for in thy life and see what is good or evil for it, man. And you prove your soul, your soul goes in, into your mental capacity, your makeup, man. What you are, what you doing, your actions, your seed of feelings. All right, that's your soul, man. You see? Go ahead. Uh, that was it, but I just the back of what the brother brought out in James was to say, if you give yourself to sin, roughly paraphrasing, yep. death's the next step. That's right. right. And that makes yeah. you a laughing stock to your enemies. Right. You get caught up in this world, get put to death, and end up on the Sunday yeah. news. Right. And you go back. You 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 know. Know. <laughs> okay. Yeah. You want to go Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 you're a joke. You're a gazer style. But you went mad long, you made a big joke. Then you back with the same nigga that you cussing up. Yeah, you get the seven. Get the seven and shit. Now you fucked up. Get in the shootouts and shit. Remember them same niggas? You back with them now. You remember them? Them guys, you the same guys you were cussing up? Yeah. You back with them now. Sitting in the car, way back like this. Now we're all goddamn chef and chip. Yeah, you know? See, they're the police. You, the business, well, them niggas, you bang with them. Them guys, man. The guys that's you know wrapping niggas up, putting them in the trunk and in, 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 in the bags and shit. Yeah. Them guys. Yeah. Hey, that's that stroke of that yoke on your mind, man. That been stroking your shit, man. <laughs> you know, it, it, hey, that's why I tell you, um, be not on um, toast to and fro. Because an unstable man is, uh, uh, I mean, a double-minded man is unstable in all his ways. You got to be forward-minded, man. You got to have tunnel vision. Bring that out right quick. Job 23 and 2. Yeah. Even today. Even today. Go ahead. Is my complaint bitter. Right. My complaint bitter. Go ahead. My stroke is heavier than my groaning. My stroke is heavier than my groaning. What you think Job was talking about, man? Job was getting it physically and mentally, man. His stroke was it, 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 it's heavier than his groaning, man. And, and we're dealing with that yoke goes into that stroke, man, of that pressure of the mind, man. Whenever you become defeated in your mind, oh, man. you finish, man. 
Get that Surat 14 and 2. When you come defeated in your mind in this world, and you like, man, even when you get to that point to I don't know what to do as a man of the Lord, don't be sitting around saying I don't know what to do. I, right, I'm telling yourself. you real. I don't give a fuck what situation this is. Don't sit back and say I don't know what to do. I mean, Before you say that, say, look, I'm about to put my thoughts in order and rearrange some thoughts to see what I'm going to do. Go ahead, man. I did a video I made Take with the man that was uh, the boy named the uh, Rocky. He came. 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 This man's whole yeah. shit, man. Can't be defeated. This white man's on the motherfucking ropes, man. He about to go. One more, one more, two punches by the most high, he's out of here. What the fuck is you giving up for, man? Well, All right? You got it up. Yeah, you got the spaghetti legs. We probably yeah. finish. I'll give a couple yeah. more brothers. Yeah. Great, I bring up, bring up what you got. This is second Ezra's 14 and, and, and uh, 14. Let go from deep mortal thoughts yeah. and cast away the burdens of men put off now the weak nature right the birds of men man because they got a lot of men that set around the men of the lord to add them off man satan is constantly around the men of the lord because he he is who we desire don't he desire to sift us as weak so he like look the ones that i got i'm gonna use the ones that get that that i don't have i'm gonna use them to get them you know oh uh, whether it's relative close loved ones uh 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 uh, childhood homies, you gotta watch that shit. Them childhood homies will grab you back in the world, man. Or come to you to seem like it's a it's a legit type of thing, but you gotta remember their minds don't fear the Lord. Yeah, yeah. You see? So when their minds don't fear the Lord, they'll gravitate you to wickedness, man. Tell you not to go walk walk with a bold fellow, man. Yeah. And if I could add, that's the reason why when a lot of that hell come. It's going to be easy to tear Jake down, man. For real. Because they live. They live and it, that, that weak nature ooze off of Jake, man. Yeah. That you know that you can go after the kids, the woman. That's it. All these different things. But when it comes down to the men of the Lord, we know where our our heart, we know where our treasure is, man. And how about Shem Yahweh Shah? It says, and set aside the thoughts that are most heavy unto thee yep. and haste. Be to flee from those times. Right. And haste to flee from those times. And it also tell you, hey, um, don't haste to flee when in trouble, man. Uh -huh. Basically what? Sit back, line the situation up, measure the situation, and deal with it. The Lord gave us wisdom to um to, uh, to, uh, to plant us, man. That plants your feet. When you uproot it, you'll do anything, man. All right? Your constitution is unconstitutional. That's right. You see? Go ahead, bro. Think about being tossed to and fro. Tossed right? to and fro, yeah. It's a uh, Surat 14 and 2. Yep. Blessed is he whose conscience have not condemned right, them. Right, that's plain. Ooh. Blessed is he whose mind has not condemned them, man. Because that's the, hey, that's that's your livelihood and the truth, man. Once you defeat it, man, Siren, to the moon you go, man. Jacob try to jump over the moon once he defeated, man. I don't know how to bring it. If they fell out of this, I don't know how you ain't kill yourself for real. Quick. Yeah, you defeated already. They, they, but really, they, the Lord ain't let them physically kill themselves, right? right? He, they killed themselves mentally, but your physical killing gotta come by. That ain't happened. Yeah, spiritually. Not a physical body. Yeah, they spiritually killed themselves. Not a physical guy, because the Lord is a great balance. You gonna get both. You gonna eat both of that. You gotta eat all that. Because it's on the basis of this. Because I gave my son a sacrifice, blood was given. So if blood must blood must go out. If you want to go out, blood must be given again, man. Yeah. yeah. Everything is, is the most high serious about that uh that sacrifice. He put the ultimate, ultimate sacrifice his son up there. Mm -hmm. So now you talking about like the scripture saying Hebrews, man, you think the whole show will get back on that cross for you, man? Yeah, man. <laughs> you tripping. And the Lord requires blood for everything. Yeah. He feel who got the land on blood. Knock him off, need blood back. The Lord a bloody man. Yeah. Bro, the whole book of the Lord is bloody. So if anybody come and tell me the birds and the bees about the Bible, I'm walking off, man. Oh, I gotta understand, like, that dude don't know the balance of the Bible. He don't know the Lord, man. 
The Lord is a man of war. And in war, all you see is blood splattered everywhere, man. Blood guts and ass. Blood, blood guts and ass, man. Go ahead, brother. Thomas rolled in blood. Uh, Surah 14 and 2. Blessed is he whose conscience have not condemned them and who has not fallen from his hope in Yahweh Blah and Yahweh Shah. Right, because once you've fallen from your hope, man, you have gone away backwards, man. You are fully gone, man. All right? And Jake. Jake don't even have the the law don't even allow him to get his thoughts back, rationalize his thoughts to even know he's gone. Jake still a think to after the fact. Jake could think he's still in the truth and don't know he's really gone. He just, he just gone. He ain't let this, this scripture escape the video, man. You know? Hey, hey, that's the, that's, the, that's the base of the script. I, I ain't even thinking about it. That's the spirit. The Lord, ain't, man, whatever the other one don't think about, the other one thinking about it. If he ain't thinking about it, he ain't thinking about it. And if they ain't thinking about it, I ain't want it to come out. I got, I got one real fast. I'm holding for good. Jeremiah 17 and 9 says, The heart is deceitful above well, all things and desperately wicked. Right, you know and these are these are scriptures where it's go, it goes back to the milk, man. The milk, is, the milk is the most essential and pivotal part of the truth, man. Yeah, you could get into the deep breakdowns and do this, but if you jump over that milk and that meat, that's why whenever Jake, whenever you entangle that bullshit entanglement with trying to figure out or rationalize with things or seeking things out too high, because uh, 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 little do we guess a right at, at at things, man. Because we still mortal. Always go back to the milk. You're not going to never go off. Never. You're not going to never be defeated or nothing. Because you're going back to the base. Yeah. All right? The foundation of everything. And that's the most important thing. That's the most, most important thing. Right. All right? You got brothers, you know, oh, mm -hmm. man, they ate. Hey, you know, you're a skyscraper. But when they get down to the milk and base things, they have escaped them, man. You can't build it. You can't build a roof. Ground, ground man. exactly, yeah, man. Yeah, Jake won't get in the roof. I could get in the camp. Yeah. <laughs> what you mean, man? You looking at this and just think this appeared overnight, man? Let me get out. You know, Can you I don't stand on this side. Yeah, yeah. 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 but you know, hey, Lord willing, you know the point was made. Exit, yeah. You know, you finished with that, brother? I can finish it all. Read it out, and then we're gonna kill it. And any wickedness, but the wickedness of a woman. But right. The you're right. The plague of the mind, man. All right, that's the destroying of the, the, the defeated part of that mental yoke of your mind, man. Right. So Jake, unlock that mental yoke, unchain those those mortal thoughts, man, and gird the, up thy loins like a man, man, and constantly endure, man. That's right. But with that, we won't give infinite honors and prayers to Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai by Shem Yahweh Double honors to the elders and apostles that do teach and rule well. Salutations to the Agnes that's pushing the truth and sincerity. Until the next time, we're going to say Shalom. 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 Shalom.